All right, guys, before I start this video, I have to explain. Cool McLaren. Um, in this video, me and Kyle, I've visited Kyle in Syracuse. You might have seen him on my channel racing me in a Z800. We did the red light uh, drill, Chinese fire drill, whatever the heck you call it. He was showing me one of the biggest malls in America, and it just so happened to have a go-kart track in it. We wanted to see how much it was, and it was only 50 bucks for both of us. We had our helmets and stuff because we were riding that day. They thought we knew what we were doing because we had our helmets on. I got a new helmet, by the way. I'll do a video on that. It's an AGV. And they were like, man, go ahead and blah, blah, blah. Go ahead and do your thing. You guys know what you're doing. You've been here before. We were like, all right, yeah. And we, and we just walked past. Didn't even watch the video, the safety video. We just walked past. I didn't know there was a video playing, first of all. Um, so you guys know, blah, blah, blah. Like, no, it's the first time. He's like, oh, oh, crap. You should have said something. We're like, ah, guys, I just thought it was like straightforward. And it kind of was straightforward. But you guys enjoy the video and subscribe for more of this because this is this is a crazy night with the sunset in the background, which you can't exactly see. But I'm having fun. Subscribe. Make sure you uh, wait to the end of the video so you can see me break down my stats and explain to you guys the graphs and all the times and all that stuff. <laughs> Are you Max? <laughs> I should have put Checo. I don't know. What the hell is that?
that blue and orange flag. I mean, somebody's going faster behind you, but I see that as go faster, not let them pass. This is amazing, bro. <laughs> So much fun. people my back is sweating that was crazy that scratches that itch a lot that was amazing oh what my best time was a 28 point a 25.8 what probably because I got that's stupid dude I'm three tenths behind somebody though I came in fourth place oh wait oh that's top times today yeah, your time's right here. Your last time, your average time. So who? So I'm one of the tops today. Alrighty, guys. End of the video. That was probably the most impromptu fun I've ever had. I'm so glad we did that. Um, did not know it was gonna be two speeds because I did not pay attention to anything they said on the screen. Now, in these results, you'll see Kyle is Max Verstappen. What he, what he said at the top of the video. I should have put Checo um, or Sergio Perez. Top left, that is your seconds on the left. You know how how fast, you're, you're pretty much your time, I guess. And that ninth lap was obviously when they slowed us down a lot. When you go to the right side, your positions are on the left and then the laps are on the bottom. Um, started off in fifth place and obviously worked my way up to first. So I was in first place on the third lap. Now let's see 
is I have my third lap time. So my third lap time was 28.9 if you go down to the bottom left. 28.988. I felt like honestly I was the fastest guy on the track, you know, but I guess I disagreed with that one. Um, my fastest lap was the 13th lap, which is a 25.805. Now, the fastest lap, I've got a bike passing by there, 600. Sound like a CBR 600. Anyways, um, was DJ Crep. Now, this says. Okay, this was in my heat. All right, so I was faster than Kyle under me. Uh, DJ Crep, 25.399. I don't know if I ever, if I even seen him on the track. I don't know if I ever passed him on the track or not, but kind of upset that I only made the fourth place and my fastest lap was the 13th lap. That means that was my, that was when I had the clearest lap. I think I only had like two laps where there was nobody and I had no, no obstruction. My 12th and my 13th lap were 25.805. When we got done, the guy said, I'm surprised you guys didn't go in the pro series race or whatever. I was like, I didn't know there was a pro thing. We never did this before. I feel like that is probably the closest thing you can get to without having to go through a bunch of hoops and like actually get your own cart and all that stuff. Those carts are actually pretty fast. Like that was the closest thing you can get to maybe doing a track day and getting that that somewhat of a fix that like adrenaline and you know hitting your line hitting the racing line hitting your apex and all that stuff that's probably the closest you can get to doing that without having to break the bank because that was only 50 bucks for the for two of us we had our own helmets well yeah i guess you had to rent your own helmet but maybe we do the pro see i don't know if there's like a third speed because that second speed was pretty fast it didn't look like it was that fast in the video but we were doing the first speed and that was kind of quick I was like all right cool this is quick I can I probably get tired of this I probably get kind of like used to this and then it kicked up and I was like oh we are moving moving and then you saw like because if you if you're obviously if you're going around a corner and you hit the brakes or you let off immediately your back end kicks out so I did that um because they they're electric and they slow down really quick so when they slow down in front of me I just let off maybe I tapped the brakes and the car just spun that was that made me giggle a lot which you could hit here if you like the video Please subscribe, click the bell. I lost, I haven't done a video in so long. I, I forget how to do a freaking outro. This is terrible. I'll see you when I see you, brother.